Haber, massive jubilation as Labour Party wins first National Assembly seat. Wow, this is good news. Um, the Labour Party, they are making moves. They are really, 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 really making moves. You see, um, it was said that it, it is not how far, but it is how well. Don't say because the party did not make it last time. They cannot make it this time. I know how the Labour Party was disarmed. How they were dejected. You know? Okay, now, look at the 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 seat of the National Assembly has just been won. And that is how gradually, gradually, before you know it, some other um, positions like the presidential seat too and other positions uh, the Labour Party actually logged into will also be won. It's a good move. Well, the people are seriously jubilating and um, even the jubilation is still ongoing in um, in um, in the southeast. Why uh, the 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 INEC officials are still doing the collation of the presidential uh, election result? Hope is still very much by the side of Peter Obi because um, he's still winning in some areas. In Nigeria, yes, yes, yes. All right, uh, let's uh, quickly check the contents and know what the people are actually jubilating about. The Independent Electoral Commission has declared Honorable Ginger Onwusi Bay of the Labour Party as House of Representatives member elect for East Yalangwa North and South Federal Constituency. Ginger, a former council chairman, defeated Governor Okezie Ikbiazu, preferred candidate, and his immediate past chief of staff, Professor Antony Agbazuere. Ginger pulled a total number of 20,411 valid votes to win this PDP opponent, who pulled a total of 13,508 votes. Ginger defeated the PDP candidate Professor Agbazure, even in his Isia Langwa South local government area. Labour Party members are currently jubilating at the coalition centre. Lobata. Ah, my people, no be smarting. The jubilation is still very much on. The people are just happy. Well, it's good. It's good. It's a great, it's a great move. Even um, the same thing goes to Peter Obi. He's also winning in some areas. Peter Obi cleared the uh, the whole of Abuja. I tell you, he cleared the whole of Abuja, and uh, he still cleared some other areas. I will give you a broadcast on the areas that Peter Obi has really cleared. But then, to what they say, the end is what justifies the means. And as we are praying, let's keep praying that God Almighty makes this very election a peaceful one. It's, it's already a peaceful one. It's already peaceful. What else can be more um, interesting than this? What do we need to be killing ourselves for when we know that um, um, the, at the end of the day, uh, uh, someone will be elected? And after, before the people are elected, we have already destroyed, killed ourselves, lost our loved ones and others. Why 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 the violence? Why don't we just maintain a low profile, maintain calmness, vote wisely and allow uh, the sleeping dog to lie? Look at it. Uh despite all of the mouth making noise making of uh, of of these same APC uh, aspirants contesting uh, in, uh, in Isia Langwa. Look at what has just happened. Even in his own hometown, he was defeated by this uh, Labour Party um, chairman. That's it. You can't, you can't predict it. You can't predict it. 
Uh, and I said that God is going to do something surprise. He's going to surprise a lot of people in this election. What a lot of people never expected is what they are going to say. That's why I start to say that it is not a joke anymore, but it's a reality. It is happening. It is happening. Let's hear you, my people. Let's know what your take, what your opinion, and what your idea on this may be. Don't forget to leave them below the comment section. Click on the subscription buttons as well as bell buttons to receive more updates. Thank you.